Imagine this, you get done with your IIT JE exam. You are really excited for exploring this world of programming. You've been hearing bhaiyas and didis on YouTube talk about programming and how it can change your life, get you opportunities in your career and build something of value to the audience at the same time. So you're really excited about building something. And that is when you enter college in hopes for meeting a group of people who share your similar vision, who share your common beliefs and interests with programming and building in general. But that is when you realize that the coding culture at your university is just not that great. People in your college are just not excited about building something together. Now, if that relates to you as it did to me, make sure that you hit the like button first of all. But in this video, I will show you exactly how can you build a coding culture in your college so that you and your peers are motivated to learn to code and build things together. The best way to improve the coding culture of your college and ensure that more people are interested in building things from scratch with the help of code is by organizing hackathons in your own college. But essentially it's a great way for you to build teams, build projects, give a solution to a problem statement, get feedback from judges and win prizes at the very end. Now the next question you might have is, how do I organize a hackathon? Like what are the steps that I need to take? How do I set everything up? How do I get sponsors? Well, relax, calm down. I will give you an exact blueprint for how you can do the exact same thing. Now, what is DevFolio you might ask? Well, basically DevFolio is a collection of people that have built intuitive tools that enable you to manage community hackathons effectively. They've managed some of the biggest hackathons of India, namely ETH India Hackathon, InOut, and many more. Now looking at the features that DevFolio offers to you if you want to organize hackathons on their platform is first of all, you gain visibility when you list your hackathon on the DevFolio platform. Secondly, you can stay up to date and track all of the applicants that are applying for your hackathon. This includes browsing through each of the applicants and an inbuilt email writing tool to notify all of the applicants that have applied. Devfolio helps you to manage your hackathon using their SaaS platform. You also get mentorship and support if you want to host a great hackathon. You can also ship swag directly to the hacker's doorstep. You'll get more applicants for your hackathon just because of the exposure and the reach that Devfolio provides. You'll also get priority support during the event within 24 hours. And to top it all off, you get to partner with great companies for exciting bounties and more prizes. When you list your hackathon on Devfolio, you get to partner with the best best names in the industry that provide bounties and prizes that promote people to participate and build on the cutting edge technology. You also get prizes worth 1.2 lakh rupees from DevFolio and the partner companies alongside the monetary support to organize great hackathons. Now when you organize your hackathon on DevFolio, a lot of companies partnering up with DevFolio will help you with the bounties as well. Let me show you exactly how this works. So first of all, we have Polygon. The way this will work is that you will get $150 for the best hack built on Ethereum, on the Ethereum platform. So this is going to come from Polygon itself. Once you do the hackathon and once you announce the winners, the best project, the best hack built on Ethereum will get $150 right there. Also, you will get $250 for the best hack built on Ethereum plus Polygon. Then you will also have an eligibility to apply for internship or full-time roles and seed funding of up to five thousand dollars for the winners right so not only will you get prizes when you build the best hack the best project on the platforms but you can also get a seed funding and you can also apply for internship or full-time roles as you can see right here for the winners then we also have ipfs interplanetary file system or Filecoin. So essentially any project that has the best usage of IPFS and or Filecoin will win $250 in prizes and bounties. If they see that this project that you've built has the potential, you can win micro grants and even open grants of up to 50,000 USD. Think how crazy that is and the opportunities it can open up for you and the product that you're trying to build. Talking about Solana, so essentially they are offering 100 USDC. 100 USDC for the best project beginners just starting out on Solana. This is called as a young gun. They also have the rising Techno King tier in which you get to win 250 USDC for the best project that goes into depth demonstrating high order code. You can also win 500 USDC for the master glass eater, which is for the best advanced project that is almost ready for full time development. Right. So these are all the tiers. You can also have an eligibility to apply for equity free grants ranging up to 
5000 USDC if you wish to continue building post the hackathon. There are a ton of projects that started from hackathons and have now become huge startups, right? Huge unicorns that they have become. And you will get equity free grants. That basically means that they will invest $5,000 up to 5,000 USDC without having an equity in your company, right? So that's basically how this works. Then we have Replit. They are offering $50 to the winning project of the hackathon, which will have to be deployed on Replit, right? So you deploy it on Replit and then you become eligible to win these $50. Now Replit is also offering swags to five eligible submissions deployed on Replit and they, you can also have an eligibility for internship or full-time role interviews at Replit itself. So not only will you win these prizes but you also have a chance to interview and intern or get a full-time job at Replit itself. This can open it up a ton of opportunities for you if you want to enter the space as a software engineer. So these are all the prizes and bounties that you will get access to when you organize your hackathon on Devfolio. Devfolio also has office hours where they'll help you to organize your hackathon better. Devfolio through their various partners will also help you with mentorship, judges, as well as speaker sessions. You can also make early connects and be a part of the elite squad of the Devfolio organizers. In addition to your dev skills, you will also get DevRel experience. You will improve your soft skills and project management skills when you will organize a hackathon for your college. Long story short, if you want to organize a hackathon, Devfolio will make it much easier for you to do so. Just a side note, if you're already organizing a hackathon on Devfolio, you are not just limited to one hackathon per semester. You can do three to four online hackathons and you can add one in-person hackathon, which would be sort of like a flagship hackathon that you can do every year in your college. You can check out the links in the description to get started if you are interested in doing the same. Not only does Devfolio make it easier for you to organize a hackathon, it also offers you 1 lakh 20,000 rupees for organizing the whole hackathon getting the bounties and the swags which will help you to motivate even more people to participate in building as much as possible that's all from me today make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe share this video with a friend of yours i will see you in the next video you can follow me on instagram and check out devfolio for organizing your hackathon i will see you in the next video bye